Hello, my lovelies, and welcome back to Firewatch. My name is Brinton, and last time we just traversed a whole month here in this national forest. Uh, we discovered that um, the girls left, but in reality, those teenage girls have been missing um, ever since we last saw them at that lake. And this time, uh, we're actually heading up to the supply drop. Um, that is what was going on when we reached uh, day 33. Uh, but that's something that I actually kind of wanted to talk about first. Uh, going back to the teenage girls as we started, as we start off uh, part five. Um, I'm not sure if it really was like an option to show. I, I, I guess what I want to say is I don't like that even though I had stated to Delilah that it was good that she mentioned that the girls had gone missing. I just don't really like how they just kind of nonchalantly uh, brushed it off. Like it was no big deal that they were just going to turn up someday or whatever. And I mean, we're a good month into um, Henry being here now. And I have the feeling that they are indefinitely missing or else they would have said something by now. So uh, I don't know. That just didn't give me a really, really good feeling that these two were just like, oh, it's no big deal, whatever. You know, they, they had it coming for them. So, I mean, people like, like I said at the end of the video, people make stupid choices and I hope that theirs didn't ultimately cost them their lives. Uh, food for two forks for lookout. All right, I got everything I need out of here. Time to chow down. Just yours, right? Who do you think I am? front row seat for what might be the biggest fire of the year oh yeah, crap I'm really going I'm gonna call it in they'll send in a hotshot crew for some suppression but I bet we'll be stuck with her for the rest of the summer and she doesn't have a name yet I usually think of something funny or something practical or a little risque when coming up with them Ooh, we get the name the fire um how about Flapjack Fire? Uh, Flapjack Fire. Can you sell that as a name? You really like that, huh? Yeah, I said I did. It's funny. Fair enough. Flapjack Fire it is. They'll probably ask me if it was a camp cooking accident or something. <laughs> that is what... The Flapjack Fire! Hell yeah! And, um, you know what my favorite thing to do is? Uh, what's that, Delilah? What's your favorite thing to do? Oh, is that her watchtower? Plunge it deep into the water and let it chill in there all day. And then on nights like tonight when it is so disgustingly hot, I have something nice and cool to drink. I learned that from my sister in Santa Fe. She'd do that with a bottle of tequila near her house and make margaritas the size of your head. Damn. You'd like it there. Um... <laughs> I've had a bad time with tequila. <laughs> a little reticent to try it again. Well, maybe you just need a new good experience with it. Uh, yeah, maybe. Are you looking at the fire? No, I'm looking at you. Oh. Well, um, let me know when you are. Okay, I'm looking at it again. I love how they look at night. During the day, it's just smoke, but when the sun is down, you can just get lost. Yeah. I'm glad you're here. Why do you say that? Because I do. I'm not crazy. I mean, we've had such a good time, right? Yeah, why not? Is she flirting with me? I know you're not really available, but I want you 
you know, well, maybe it'd be nice to get together at the end of the summer. Um. Um. We don't have to plan or even talk about it. I'm. I'm just having the thought. Yeah, she's flirting with us. All right. Um, I'm gonna be silent about this. Somebody. We could talk without these radios. We could, um, you know. What could we do? What could we do? Well, let me tell you. fishing without a license it's one fish and i'm sick of all the stuff i got to eat no well, i won't tell anyone you're a poacher that reminds me i keep hearing reports from fish and game about a problem bear they're trying to keep tabs on can you search around the lake for fresh tracks and just let me know what you find there was a crew burning fire lines out to the east and um you know i think sometimes it riles up the wildlife Um, uh, yeah, sure, sure thing. Why not? You are such a drama queen. <laughs> I can't believe I'm going to leave this planet as a pile of bear shit. Thank you, Henry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, this is where the teens' campfire was before. Their backpacks are gone, and, well, their underwear is gone, then Kevin's. Uh, that means we really are super close to uh, the lake then. I just didn't recognize this area since uh, we came down here the first time when it was um, in the evening time. So this is really nice in the daytime. Very nice. Uh, so I guess we're going to be looking for uh, bear tracks while we are fishing as well, it sounds like. Oh my gosh, am I just like waist deep in the water? Yeah, I am just waist deep in the water. Sounds good to me, I guess. How do I take out my fishing rod? Um, nope, I don't want that. That's my compass. That's my map. Wait, does it say anything specifically? Oh, there's a cash box up there. I'm going to go get that cash box, actually. Uh, oh, we're actually going to search for bear tracks. That's why we're not fishing. Okay, that makes sense. Um, well, let's go up to where that cache is. Maybe I haven't gotten it yet. Or maybe I have. Well, if I did, then I would have, have updated my map. That's That I know for sure. Uh, let's go ahead and find it. How about we do that? <laughs> then we can determine if I've actually gotten it or not. Um, where is it? Okay, I completely passed it. So I need to go back down here. Here we go. I need to go up here because I did not even know this was here until I turned around. Um, oh, cool. And we can go down here if, if we want to. Is that where the cash box is by chance? Nope, that's in the completely different direction. So I still need to go this way. Oh, oh, okay. I thought that was a bug, but no, it is just a leaf. Um, because I apparently can't tell the difference between a leaf and a bug now. Um, are these just leaves? Those are weird shadows. I don't know what to say. I found the cash box. Just, just shut up, Brenton. Shut up. Let's just open this. One, two, three, and four. Okay, let's update the map and check it out. Okay, cool. So we just got more trails that lead all the way up to uh, Wat PT Meadow. Okay. Cool. I am 
cool with that. We still missed that one down there. Wouldn't mind getting it if I had the chance later. Old sweater. Obviously, I can't take that. The fourth estate. Uh, let's take the note. Let's see what this says. Uh, August 29th, 1986. Ron, I got some bad news back at home, so hopefully they'll let me out of here for a while. Who's to say, though? Budgets being what they are. Did you get my note about what went down in Wapiti? Sheriff isn't too pleased with me, but I don't know. I probably overdid it. Wish you would have been there. I guess you must have got hung up. Dave. P.S. Amigos in Spanish and Profesionales is is Italian. Um, no, it's not. If you want to say professionals in Italian, that is not how you say it. It's probably um, close to the very obvious Spanish word on the on the screen, but it is um, but it is that is not how you say professionals in Italian. Sorry, sorry, Ron. I mean Dave, but that's just that's not it. <laughs> Fail. Um, let's find those bear tracks now. Let's see here. Um, I don't see anything in particular along here. Um, I wonder if there's more like, no, I can't go that way. Um, bear tracks. Where are you? Where are you? Come out wherever you are. I need to get over there, but it's not going to let me... There's like an invisible wall right here. Yeah, I need to get around there somehow. So let me see here. That shouldn't be too hard. I, I'm thinking I just need to go back up this way. Yeah, okay. So anyway, um, okay, so I do need to go down this way, which is fine. But um, do I not have any more rope? Oh, I need to find the bear tracks first. Okay, so obviously I can't go down there. Um, and I guess this is just where, obviously, like, he 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 he. Um, I obviously don't know what I'm looking for, which I feel like Matt is now going to make fun of me for. Um, because like I said, I am outdoorsy, but I'm not that outdoorsy. It's not like I can just randomly find bear tracks and be like, oh, look, bear tracks. Oh, I can drop down here. Okay. Okay, so I'm guessing they have to be down here then of sorts. Um, let's go over here. I hope a big old grizzly doesn't just pop out of nowhere and attack me. That is not something I will appreciate or enjoy in the slightest. I feel like I just started from the beginning again. I really don't know exactly what I'm looking for. So that is entertaining in the slightest. Um, well, maybe entertaining for you all. Whereas for me, I'm just like, I don't know what I'm doing. And I bet you all are just like, you're passing the tracks. You're being stupid. And to that, I respond, yes. Yes, I most likely am. What are y'all going to do about it? Okay, saving. Great. Um... Well, I'm back where I started, and I don't really see any bear tracks still. And I'm not sure how much more of this lake I can actually um, explore before I've run out of lake to explore. That obviously was concrete. Uh, let's look at the map. Okay, obviously I am going in the wrong direction now because I don't think there would be anything else um, in the direction I was going. Oh, there's a clipboard. Someone left their clipboard out here. 
Huh. Well, it could have been one of the fish and game folks. See if there's a name or a credential or something. I can call it in. What? The, uh, it's... Holy shit. What's going on? You didn't actually find a bear, did you? Someone has written down what we said to each other, have been saying. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you, not in the same way. No way. Wait. Okay, I am very creeped out right now. Henry, I'm worried. You didn't find and eat any mushrooms, did you? I mean, they can be fun, but... I'll I found a walkie-talkie out here, too. Uh, okay. It's going shithouse. Oh! Henry, are you there? What happened, Henry? I... Holy hell, I just... I got hit in the head. Punched or something by someone. Holy crap. Holy freaking crap. I don't know. Jesus Christ. Let me get this straight. You found a clipboard with, what, transcripts of our conversations? What else is on it? I don't know. It's gone, along with a radio of theirs. You know, somebody out here could have just killed me, Delilah. <sighs> I don't... What the fuck is going on? What's Wapiti Station? I, 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 I don't know. I saw the name Wapiti Station right before I was cold cocked. Does Wapiti Station mean anything to you? Wapiti Meadow. Maybe it's Wapiti Meadow. It's it's on our maps. It's not too far from where you are right now. It's north of the lake. It, it looks like there should be a trail somewhere on the north shore of Jonesy Lake. Well, I'm already in that direction, girl. Um, holy crap. I'm so sorry if I scared anybody um, when I screamed, when I kind of screamed there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, there are people listening to our conversation. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I did not mean to scare anybody at all if that is what I did. I just got super startled. I was not expecting that to happen. And I'm a little scared right now. There is somebody who is clearly eavesdropping on us and I, I'm, I'm a little scared. Um, I don't like this at all. <laughs> What's to say that they don't have transcripts from three, four or five weeks ago? Our entire relationship, friendship, our, our whole summer. Someone is out here with a walkie-talkie taking notes and talking to God knows who. I'll hike out there and get some answers. Great. Look, just keep a clear head. Don't, you know, do anything crazy. Like taking a job in the middle of nowhere with literally no escape from whatever or whoever is out there? Well... I meant, like, kill anybody. You got it, boss. Am I close to the meadow? Um... Oh no, I just ran up Thunder Canyon! Oh, you ought to be kidding me! I just ran up Thunder, Thunder Canyon, I just went the wrong way the entire time, damn it! I called around. Things seem normal with everyone else. Has anything strange been happening on your end? No, nothing really. Nothing really or nothing? Nothing. My door was open the other night, but that's not strange. That doesn't sound like nothing. It's nothing, I promise. Keep your radio close to you. Hey, what you just said, keep my radio close to me. Yeah? Before I got attacked back at the lake, I saw a radio on the ground. Kind of like the one I used. And? Do you think that maybe someone was, you know, uh... I don't know. What? Maybe intercepting our frequency with other radios or something. Henry... It's just a thought. I, I don't even know how you would do that. Yeah, well, you sound worried. No, I'm not, okay? Let's not spin out of control. Just keep hiking. Whatever you say, boss. 
Yeah, give me just a second to go the right way this time real quick. And um, and then we'll be good to go because Brenton's an idiot and ran up Thunder Canyon and completely neglected the fact that I needed to go this way. Oh my gosh, again, I'm going to be like saying this for the rest of the video and even possibly like the rest of the series. I am so sorry if I scared anybody. I was not expecting what happened to happen. I didn't even like see anybody. All of a sudden, like I thought I got shot for a second and I was about to freak out and be like, no, no, not, don't shoot Henry. He needs to, he needs to get his head on straight and go back home and go to Melbourne to see his wife. Um, but I am like severely creeped out right now. There is somebody, there's feds. Whoa, Delilah, there's a, big chain link fence between me and the meadow I, I don't think I can get past it uh, a fence yeah how big big it goes off in both directions acres but what the fuck is going on out here whatever it is someone doesn't want anyone to know about it sometimes biologists will cordon off a little area to study flora or whatever but that's only a few square feet usually that's not what this is <sighs> well See what you can do to get past it. Get through the fence. All right. Oh, look, here's a door. And what are the odds they left the gate unlocked? Pretty low, I'd imagine. Oh, did I? Okay, so I need to get through the fence somehow. Um, obviously I can't go in that direction. That gate is locked. Oh my gosh, my... Oh, I'm trying to calm down. That freaking... That freaking moment just terrified me. I was not expecting it at all. Um, how do I get through this fence? Um, crap. I don't, I don't know what to do. I don't know how to get through the fence. Uh, and there's people here and they're doing weird things. Looks like goddamn Area 51. Maybe they've got aliens. That'd be exciting. Yeah, we'll see about that. Yeah, let's hope it's just aliens. Oh, loose stone. I'm going to use it to open the gate. Okay, so that was a big no. Uh, let's try this again. Okay, that is a big no still. Um, there's all these stones. And then they just disappear after you can't use them. Look, I'm not going to be able to get into this place. Ah, oh, shit. I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. God, if you were an actual firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled burn, they might be able to help. Where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. Okay, so I need to go to the scout camp down there. Where am I? I am all the way up here. Okay. Um, wow, that is going to be quite a hike. Um, Maybe I can get to that one cache, like that one right above Cottonwood Creek. I think it's number 308. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and get to Medicine Wheel, and then I'll meet you all in the next part. So I will go ahead and end the video off here. Um,
thank you guys so much for watching i'm actually gonna look at my map just in case uh what's your face starts talking to me again but again thank you guys so much for watching please leave me a like it really does let me know that you are enjoying the series i really am uh i really i i'm loving firewatch i i think the plot is starting to thicken and things are starting to get really really interesting now um and i really can't wait to see what happens next uh so subscribe so you can see with me as well my name is brenton thank you again for watching and i will catch you guys next time bye